So on the one hand, we want to receive more clients, more money, more support, more love. And on the other hand, it can feel like we're too exhausted to let it in because in our minds, that takes work, that takes effort, and I just don't have it. This is one of the major blocks I'm actually seeing right now with the entrepreneurs that I coach is that they have the big impact dream that they want to make this year, 2021, but they feel like they're going to be overwhelmed with everything just coming at them. I liken it to imagine that you, you have a dinner party tonight and you've got friends and the doorbell goes at, at 7 p.m. and you're not ready. What's your response? If your response is, oh fuck, I'm not ready, and you start kind of rushing around and you kind of like that, check in with yourself. Is it possible that I'm still running this knock template that tells me I have to serve, but I'm not going to be served. I have to support, but I'm not going to be supported. I have to give, and I'm just going to get judgment and psychic attack in response. If when that doorbell rings, you're like, oh, fab, it's my friends. There's no judgment with them. They won't care that I can't cut potato up neatly. They don't care that there's washing up in the sink. They're just going to come and they're just going to love me and I'll be supported and I'm going to love them. And it's just beautiful. There's no stress. Then that's your sign. You probably are not having huge blocks right now to actually receiving because you see receiving as support. If you've had a history with narcissistic abuse, if you've had a history of a lot of one-sided relationships, for you, perhaps receiving didn't feel so nice. It didn't feel like support. What it felt like was attack or criticism or judgment or psychic attack. Maybe for you, receiving felt dangerous, right? You felt like you weren't emotionally safe. You felt like you'd be talked about or people would take the information that you'd shared and kind of shit all over it. Noticing your relationship with receiving is one of the basic groundworks that a lot of us, and me included, have to keep revisiting. So if you find when that friends, where your friends come over, say tonight, really look at yourself. Am I looking at them as a support? Or am I looking at them as the judges? Like I have to be totally perfect for them. What am I playing out here? And it's gonna show you your relationship with receiving. If clients and people and money represent exhaustion, effort, and maybe that you're gonna lose something, what are you gonna do? You're gonna push it away, right? You're gonna go, yeah, no thanks, mm, I don't want it. Right, we're all gonna do that. And that's one of the blocks, the upper limits of getting to the next level because we often associate it with pain. And even though we say these words, actually seeing it for ourselves is a huge game changer. And then actually clearing ourselves so we can freely receive without feeling like we are going to lose something. So that's what I have done with my clients for 17 years. Most of my clients are entrepreneurs. And it's something I'm offering to you now. I feel like we're at the beginning of 2021, right? Because the new year was actually in March. And it feels like a lot of us have felt exhausted. We have had PTSD from the last year we've had, maybe a mild form, maybe more extreme. And it feels like we need to release now any NARC template, right? That we're still running through our business in order that we can actually receive the support we need because then we look at people and money and what have you actually as support. So we need to clear the deep energetics that are still holding your abundance at bay, right? And of course, if you don't feel safe to receive, you're not going to. And that's where you can feel like you're literally banging your head against a brick wall, especially if you are really talented at what you do. You already know you're brilliant at what you do. And I know that everybody I know, everybody that what you are, right? We've all got our speciality. We've all got our thing that we're utterly brilliant at. And so if you're still running that old energy through into your business, I call it a knock template, then absolutely book in. I'm offering a three session package 
to really go in deep and really release this from your business and to really create now a much wider ability for you to actually receive because you know this time it's going to be utterly supportive of you and your dreams and where you're going. So it's not just about the other person, it also feeds you, it has to be reciprocal now for you in order to receive it. So if you're interested in that, PM me or DM me or whatever, and me, right? Because I'm on all these different channels, I have no idea. And, um, and I will let you know more about it. So yeah, I'm just, just wanted to share that with you today. All my love, bye.